Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Runner 24 seven. And in today's video, we wanna show you how to set up your email and multiple email accounts on your Galaxy A11. So now that you have your uh, A11 all set up and you're wanting to set up your email, first thing you need to do is locate your general email icon on your phone. So this would represent the general email icon here. And while we call it the general email icon is because you can set up different email accounts under it so under that icon you can set up your Yahoo you can set up your Gmail and you can set up Hotmail or whatever email account you're looking to set up and so once we've uh, located that we're gonna go ahead and tap on it to open it and once we open it we come to this particular menu where it says set up email and so the first email we want to set up is a Gmail account because this is a Samsung phone Samsung runs off a Android and so Android is associated with Gmail and so we automatically have a Gmail account so we're going to tap on Gmail real quick and now we get a message that says allow email to access your contacts so we'll say allow and now it shows us that select account and so this particular email account here is what we set up on uh, with Samsung and so it's natural to go ahead and set that up as your first email account so we're going to tap on that and then it takes us to the next screen here uh, where it says sign in and already has the email address there. We're going to hit next and then it's asking for the password for that email address. So we're going to go put our password in real quick. Now once we have our password in, we're going to hit go and now it's asking us to allow. So we hit allow and now it's setting up our first email account. And so that email has been set up. So you, now you can see your inbox of that particular email. So next we wanna go ahead and add an additional email to our phone. So what we would do is go up here to where those three lines and that's kind of considered a sandwich menu. Tap on that to open it. And then you will see uh, this menu, uh, which has your email, current email address already. So hit that gear button up at top right. Once you hit that, you will see this particular screen. And now we wanna hit add, cause we wanna add an additional account. And so hitting that add will take us to this menu again where it says set up email account. So we're gonna go ahead and set up another Gmail address. So we're gonna hit Gmail again. And now it's going to ask us for the uh, email account that we want to set up. And so we're gonna go with a different email address real quick. And so we'll get our email address put in and then we'll hit next. And now we need to uh, put the password in. And now that we have the password in, we hit next. And now it's setting up our second email address. And so now as you can see that email address has been set up. And we're looking at the inbox. So we're gonna hit our home button real quick and come out. And uh, just to show you what it looks like, uh, we're going to clear out everything real quick, close everything. And now we're going to hit our general email icon again. And it shows that particular email address again. But if we hit that sandwich menu, you'll see now that it shows that first email we put in and now the second. Now you can look at each one of those individually, one at a time. So that particular one is what we're looking at now or we can go to this one and it'll show that. We're gonna hit that menu again, or you can hit all accounts and it would show all the uh, email that are in the inboxes of both accounts at the same time. So we're gonna do some slightly different this time. We're gonna hit that sandwich menu again and we're gonna add a third email, but this time we're gonna do one through Yahoo. So we hit that gear again. And as you can see, we have the two emails there we're going to add another account. Now this account is going to be a little different. It's through Yahoo, but it actually is for AT&T. And so AT&T use Yahoo to generate their email. So we're going to hit Yahoo. And when we hit Yahoo, it's going to open this menu up here. And it's going to ask you for the email address that you want to put in there. And so we're going to put our email address name in there real quick. 
And so as you can see, this is the email address that we put in is Melvin7474 at ATT.net. But they use Yahoo to generate their email. So we're gonna hit next. And it wants us to sign in through this server here, which kicks it to ATT. That symbol uh, represents ATT. So we're gonna put the same email address back in there one more time. And this time we're gonna add the uh, password into it. And so after we get our email address put in and the password, we're gonna hit sign in. They were asking to uh, say the username and password, say not now. And so now that we've signed it, ask you to agree, hit agree. And now it's loading the email under our general email icon. And as you can see, it says there, Melvin7474 at att.net. And like I said, it's through the Yahoo setup. And so now if we were to hit that sandwich menu or the three lines again up there now, you will see that we have three accounts set up now. We have that one, the original, the second one, Gmail, and now an att.net email address. And so we have three different email addresses set up under our general email icon. So that's about it for our video for today, how to set up your email and to set up multiple email accounts on your Galaxy A11. So hopefully we shared something that you can use and something that was beneficial. If so, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and hit the uh, like button and don't forget to hit the uh, bell icon too so you can be notified of new content as soon as we release it. So again, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7, bringing you technology that's on the move. Thanks.